Lingering snow across eastern Kentucky right now. Let's take a look outside the WYMT studio and you can see still coming down. Not as heavy as it was earlier, but we have several inches in our front yard, about eight inches uh, to be exact right now. Pinpoint Doppler still showing the snow uh, beginning to lighten up a little bit back towards Moorhead, West Liberty, over towards Sayersville, uh, down along the Mountain Parkway as drier air is coming into the storm system. Still some heavier bands, though, through Clay County into Leslie County, southeastern Laurel County. Portions of Knox, Harlan, and uh, Bell County seeing some decent snow bands. Same story over in Nanak County, Southern Floyd County, Pike County still picking up on the decent snow, although uh, tapering off a bit up towards Paintsville and Johnson County. That dry air will continue to work into the system, whittle away the backside of it, and cause the snow to taper off here in a few hours. We'll go from heavy, steady snow into snow showers and flurries in about four or five hours from now. Winter storm morning continues through midnight for most of the region. Uh, starting to lose the daylight on our traffic cams, but you can see still snow covered folks. The plows are just going to have a hard time with this. You don't have to be out tonight. Just stay on in and uh, just let those road crews do their thing to try to get the roads in decent shape for the morning commute tomorrow. The snow will taper off after midnight, but we're down to 11 degrees tomorrow morning and highs only into the 20s. Right now, already teens in Paintsville and Jackson will only fall a few more degrees there. And uh, wind chill five right now in the Jackson. Brr. And folks, even colder temperatures than that. Colder air temperatures than our wind chill heads our way later in the week. Here's a look at future view. You can see by around midnight, we begin to taper the snow off. Uh, some locations may make a run into the lower single digits back up in central Kentucky, especially if they clear those clouds out tonight. We'll go into the low 20s for highs tomorrow. Teens for highs on Wednesday as another Arctic front rolls in, and this one will bring us more snow. Not a lot, just about an inch or two for most of eastern Kentucky, but uh, that will go down on top of several inches that just will not melt over the next couple of days, friends. This snow is sticking around, and it's not moving anywhere fast. Winter weather impacts, snow, the cold, and the roads continue to remain in bad shape, but thankfully not dealing with too many power outages. The snow forecast remains on track, although down into the uh, southern end of the coverage area may end up on the lower side of that as that snow is wrapping up and that sleet did cut down on those totals like we were talking about earlier. The big story though remains the cold Thursday morning low 12 below zero 20 below zero right now Friday but that's assuming the snowpack holds up and we clear those skies out Friday morning but if that happens that could be an all-time record low for the Weather Service office in Jackson. That's something we're going to have to keep a very close eye on. Don't go anywhere. More Mountain News after this.